Today's advent calendar is the Lerva. Um, it is going for 9,700 gold, which is quite a bit. So it's a quite quite a lot more than the Hawk 30 was yesterday. Um, but the Lerva has always been like one of the most expensive tanks in the game. Um, in fact, it could be the most expensive tank that you can still buy all the time in like the tech tree. Now, I did do a full review, which you can find up there in the top right of your screen. Um, if you want to go and look at that and I'll go through everything about the tank and how it feels, how it stacks up in today's kind of gameplay. Um, it's it's a nice tank. I do like it. However, I do know that it is expensive. So if you want to buy it for gold, it is 9,700, nearly 9,800. Or if you want to buy it with real money, it's about 30 pounds. So it is quite expensive. That is, you know, like 14 pound more than the Hawk 30 was. I still like the tank. I think that it's still capable in today's kind of environment um, in the game and it can still earn you a lot of credits. Um, it gets really, really nice standard rounds that you don't have to fire uh, premium rounds for. But when you do, you can just go and, you know, load the gold and you get 294 millimeters of pen, which is really, really nice. And 234 standard rounds. Um, HE runs aren't too bad at 60 pen, but the worst thing about this tank is it's DPM. Although, at the same time, it does get really, really accurate gun. So, it kind of negates some of that because you will hit the majority of shots that you shoot. So yes, it's expensive, but I think that if you're going to buy a tier 8, I'd probably just wait. Because I, I do think that there are better tanks than this. So if, you're, if you can only buy one tier 8 premium, I wouldn't wait for the Lerva. And at the end of the day, you're only realistically saving about £5, um, all in all, on this package. So although, yes, I do love this tank and I do recommend it, if you can only afford one, I would wait and see what else is on offer. Because there are better tanks on in the game. So hopefully I did help you out. Remember, click your mission of the day. For completely for free. The, today's mission is be among the top five players on your team by the following parameter experience earned and you get a nice credit booster. Again, it's a nice way of earning some credit boosters ready for when holiday ops start and then you can really grind out the credits when that happens. So hopefully that was useful and I'll see you all tomorrow for the next advent calendar.